In this problem, we have two fractions, 4 over 5 times 5 over 8, and we're multiplying them. That's what the dot means. So whenever you have fractions and you're multiplying, you can cancel diagonal terms. For example, the 5's here. 5 goes into 5 one time, so you can put a line through the 5 and put a 1 here. Put a line through the 5 and put a 1 here. And then the 4 and the 8, same thing. We have some cancellation here. You put a line through the 4 and put a 1 here because 4 goes into 4 one time. Then you do the same thing here. Put a line through the 8 and put a 2 here because 4 goes into 8 two times. And now we're finally ready to multiply. So 1 times 1, just multiply straight across. 1 over 1 times 2 is 2. What a nice answer. Wow. So 1 over 2. Now, let's say that you're doing this problem and you don't want to do all this, right? Let's say let's do it another way. Say you have 4 over 5 times 5 over 8. And say, hey, you know what? I just want to multiply straight across. I don't want to do all this. Well, that's fine. Watch this. 4 times 5 is 20. 5 times 8 is 40. You get 20 over 40. So you're almost correct, right? You're just not done. Because now you can say, okay, 20 goes into 20 one time. So you cross out the 20 and you put a 1. 20 goes into 40 two times. Cross out the 40, put a 2. This is equal to 1 over 2. So you can do it this way too, uh, whatever seems easier. I hope this video has been helpful. Good luck.